is Wednesday, the 15th of February. Happy belated Valentine's Day. So, today was very exciting. I got up extra early, which is not actually that early, but for me it was extra early, and I got on the orange route, arrived at an apartment complex where I turned in a parental guidance form and $325 cold hard cash. The most cash I have ever held in my hand. It was a very weird experience. Signed a lease and now have an apartment that I'm going to move into in August. I'm going to be living with Evie who has been on this channel. She is my college best friend. We've been roommates before although we are not this year. And we're going to be roommates again but we're not going to be room mates because we each have our own room because as much as I love Evie we have very different standards of cleanliness. Mine are much lower than hers. I'm a disaster and she's like an organized person. There's a reason that all you ever get to see of my room is this box of wall. Sometimes also that box of wall. But even then you can start to see the disaster. Look at that. That's just the beginning. God, my room is a mess. I am so immensely excited. My whole brain is being taken up with plans for next year. And I know that not all of them are completely realistic and that not all of them are going to pan out quite the way I expect them to and then I I'm a lazy person and I, I'm probably just gonna make pasta a lot but this will give me the opportunity to do things like cook good healthy and delicious meals which I like to do I'm gonna get a crock pot I might get a rice cooker I'm gonna make food on the weekends and eat leftovers all week like our mom I'm gonna make Indian food and I'm gonna make sushi and I'm gonna make risotto, I'm gonna make cucumber salad, and like there's not really anything stopping me from doing that now, but it's inconvenient. I'm going to light candles and make Shabbos every Friday night, which I have not been able to do because I live in a dorm where you can't light candles. I want to be able to be more Jewish in my own space. You know, to have things like my own little Tubishvat Seder. Definitely a Passover Seder. And it is going to mean buying a whole bunch of things. Because, like, we need a vacuum cleaner. I'm going to need new sheets. going to need so much stuff. I actually made a spreadsheet. Because you know me, Abe. If there is a task that I am dreading or excited about, my way of coping with any emotions at all is to make a spreadsheet. I feel like this is an opportunity to become a grown-up, and if you know me, I have been striving since birth to become a grown-up. There are definitely moments where I'm like, oh, responsibilities, let me just hide in a cave of childness, but for the most part, I just want to be a grown-up. Things like autonomy and maturity and self-determination, I'm so hype about that. Forging my own path into the future. I will see you on Saturday. Goodbye.